Hello. Hello, hello. Hello. Can you hear me okay? Hi, Mom. Hi, Lane. I'm streaming using a different way, so let me know if you can hear me and see me and all that kind of jazz. I'm like a robot. What? Kids are going crazy. Let me know if I'm okay, if you can hear me, see me, all that kind of stuff. Is that better now? I had to close some of the windows that I had open. But you can hear me, yeah? I'm just going to check. How are you all? It's been a while since I've done a live. Um, mainly because nothing much has really been going on. Apart from the disastrous health stuff, but we'll get to that. There you go. I'm just, I've just checked. It should be okay. You're knackered, mum, are you? Aren't you always tired? It's the joys of working in retail. Has everyone got their tea? Or, in my case, energy drink? Let me know if you're here. Say hello. You fell over, Mum. You bid on the drink again. Are you okay? Or do I need to ring you after? So, how has everyone been? I don't know if the comments are coming through slow or... What? Your arm is badly bruised and leg. Why do you not phone me? Kids are still messing around.
Well, I'm going to bring you after the stream. How are you all? How is everyone? The chat in this is really slow. This is like the main kind of YouTube streaming service. So it's not like um, the other one I did, which was kind of like a almost like a web chat so let me go let me know guys if you like this one or the other the one we did before I don't know if I'm just missing the chat. I'm going to just check it on here and see if it's coming up on here. Because they're saying there's more of you. Oh, I don't know. Maybe I should have just done it the same old way. <laughs> Okay, so I've got more comments in my, in here. Who's here? So I've got Elaine, I've got Mum, who else is here? Say hello in the chat if you can find it. If you scroll down, there should be like an option for it to leave a comment. Just to let me know that you're here and that you can hear and all the jazz. Yeah, six watching. That's what I've got as well. It was a little bit glitchy then. My um, screen was saying something else. So how is everyone apart from mum falling over? Um, it's been a little bit crazy here. Uh, World book. Well, I think it is World Book Day today, but my kids' school aren't doing it till tomorrow. So there's a lot of costume prep happening here today. So I've had to pop out and do a few bits. I got my confirmation through for my um, appointments for rheumatologist? Rheumatologist, yeah, uh, in April, so that's good. Um, what else has happened? Uh, Mia was up all night last night. <laughs> uh, well, no, she was up at four um and then was up was up quite a bit throughout the night just apparently wanted to go to school at four o'clock this morning so I'm running on a lot of these <laughs> she's fine she's okay she's not unwell or anything she's um she just was wide awake she'd got her full amount of sleep apparently and was wanting to come downstairs and get dressed and, and go to school. I'm not complaining obviously because I'm going to have troubles with her probably when she's a teenager but it would have been nice to have had a bit more sleep. Oh, dearie. I'm just keep making sure that I'm not missing comments. Because it's a little bit laggy. You're, I think you're a, about five seconds behind. <laughs> or I'm five, no, I'm five seconds behind. But yeah, I'm gonna just quickly pop on Instagram to let Instagram know that we are live. 
There we go. So cheese. <laughs> Uh. But there you go. So yeah, so um confirmation of the appointment it's I think it's on like the second week of April. My hair is doing sound funky. Um, yeah, second week of April. Can you see actually where it's supposed to be blue? Tell me if it's blue in the in the to you guys. But um, <laughs> I said to Mia this morning, I said, "Ah, oh, mummy dyed her hair blue again." She went, "Mummy, no, it's black." Thanks, thanks, Mia. Brutally honest of a seven year old. Um, but no, yeah. So she's um. Uh, at that point, it's sorted. I know it's on a Wednesday in the second week of April, some point along the month. And so I've got to see her. And I have um, inquired into putting in a complaint about the surgeon. I know a few of you were telling me that I should put in a complaint. Um, if you didn't watch the health update, the surgeon that I see was a little bit mean. Um, so I had... Uh, have inquired about putting a complaint in about him. I feel bad. I don't. <laughs> I don't want to put in a complaint in about um about anyone really. But if someone's that unprofessional, you know. So I kind of want to wait and make sure that people are able to see me and comment and stuff. Um, if you can't comment or if you don't know where the comment section is, um, just scroll down. If not, send me a message or comment on the post saying that we're live on Instagram so I know you can hear. Hi, Rosanna. Don't worry, honey. I've not ordered any waffles without you. This is good friend stuff. Um... I've lost my train. Of, this is what you do to me, Rosanna. I've lost my train of thought. <laughs> okay, so I think you can hear. But if anyone, if anyone jumps in, we'll kind of keep them up. To, I'm keeping an eye on like three different devices here. So I, um, if you haven't seen on Instagram, oh, everyone's saying hello to everyone. Uh, if you haven't seen on Instagram, I have been dabbling. I, I'm not coming away from scrapbooking. I'm still scrapbooking and planning everything on my channel. But i am kind of been working on something else. I've been um, very bound to my chair that you can see me on here. Um, my very new chair that I am loving. Um... That I yeah, so it's it's my Stephen calls it my throne. <laughs> um so yeah. So um Rosanna, she's probably been on the drink. <laughs> no, you haven't, Mum, I promise. Um but no, yeah, so um I have been working on some stuff here so obviously I've been posting a few um mum I'll give you a ring after the stream make sure you're okay um I've been working on a few bits here and I've basically been working on some clay charms I actually have some tools in the background here which I might be making some on here in a bit um so yeah, I've been working on planner charms, some clay charms. I've been practicing for quite a few months now. I kind of started with like a um like a cheaper version of clay, which was from AliExpress.com, which was more uh, uh air drying clay. So it was a little bit um a little bit difficult to get to get going with. Um, but I made some charms. I'll show you actually. Can I, are they in here? I have like a whole tray. I'm just going to pop this over here. I have like a whole tray 
of charms that I've been making. I've just thrown them all on the floor. There we go. Hi, Holly! Hi, babe. Um, yeah, so the first charms I started with, was, which were the foam charms. We're just talking about charms. Oh, I'm just decapitated a bunny. Well, that's not good. One of the reasons I didn't like this first clay, which was an air drying clay, is because it just falls apart. So this was one of the ones that I made. Um, it's just like a little camera. Uh, that was that was made out of like the air drying stuff and it's still quite squishy. Um, and then we have my decapitated body. He was missing an ear and as I've plunked him down here, I've just decapitated him again. But that was another one I started. Um, there we go. And then um, this, who remembers this guy? From the Eon adverts. Yeah, my mum's in the chat. Be nice to my mum. Um, so yeah, this is actually one of the ones that went wrong. His eyes ended up huge. There is another one that's fallen down there that's a little bit better. So this was the first clay I started with. Mum, I am making your Betty Boo. I'm just waiting for the flesh colour clay to turn up. Otherwise she'd have to have like green skin or something. Um, so yeah, this is the kind of foam stuff. And then I kind of stepped up a gear, so I went into some polymer clay, called polymer clay, which is the baking clay, which I got from Tiger. Uh, Rosanna, you'll know her, how excited I got when I found the clay in Tiger. I think I texted you. Mum, was you with me? I think you were with me when I bought that. Um, called Betty Bloop. I've just realised she spelled that wrong, Mum. Um, but yeah, so where's, so I went on to making these, so these are with the cheaper clay, this guy's got some fluff on his head, so we have a little pumpkin, that was with the cheaper clay, I'm just trying to remember what ones I made with which now, um, oh here we go, and then we have my little strawberry, I love this guy. He's on a keyring as well. He's pretty cool. And then we have. I'm trying to remember. I've been <laughs> messing around. Um. Yes. And then we have a stack of planners. The tiger clay was really, really good, Holly. The only thing I found with the uh, uh the baking clay from Tiger was the more you worked with it the stickier it got so you had to be quite quick when you were like forming stuff so if you can see with stuff like this it's not quite straight and as as straight as I'd want it to be <laughs> Bagsy the whole stash you know Rosanna when you come over at some point in the next few days you're gonna have first dibs on half of this <laughs> some of these are glazed some of them have not I've been playing around with some glaze and stuff but this is a little planner stack that I've been working on so this was the first sort of clay as well. So it does make some really cool ones. I have a little, um, this was the first, was it the first? Yes, this was the first donut I made. Um, and then we have a little bee. This one's not glazed. I kind of stopped glazing these ones because I'd ordered my new clay. Hi, Natalie. You like the planner stack. You'll exchange by leaving half. Oh, thanks. <laughs> yeah, these are all yours, Rosanna. And then um, I think one of my favourites that I've made is my little my little carrot. They all need names. So um, this little carrot was um, the old clay as well. So this cheaper clay was actually really, really good. I still have some left, but I don't have a lot left. So I did upgrade to the Fi Fimo, 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 uh, clay. I will show you it. I've upgraded uh, to 
it's not air drying, so you can just leave it out, but I prefer it in here so like it keeps like kids away. Um, so yeah, so this is the clay I'm on now. This is the Fimo soft clay. You can get a kids version and a professional version, I believe. Oh, just with carrot after the yes, that's his name now, Holly. Because you named him, I think he 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 might be making his way to you, Holly. If, when I see you at an event next, come find me, Holly. And I'll give I'll give you I'll give you just the carrot. I've got to put a little charm on him for you, a little clip. Um. But if you look, this is like some remnants of some older clay. So as you can see, it's quite shiny. And then if you look at this, which is the Fimo clay, it's not. It's quite. It's more matte. It's a less shiny version. So this is a lot easier to work with. This gets quite sticky. But this is good to practice with when it comes to like baking times and stuff like that. Remind me to say no if you offer me a celebration chocolate. Rosanna, when have I offered ever offered you chocolate? I just put it in front of you. <laughs> no worries, Holly, that's fine. So yeah, so this is the clay that I've been working on now and I will show you I've got so many like little cookie cutters and stuff in here. I might make some charms on here for you. If you've got any ideas of what you'd like me to make live, let me know. Um, so yeah, I've got a whole stash of them. So these are some of the ones I've been making with the new clay. So we have some Marmite. Who are the Marmite lovers? Are you going to get your craft on? Is that the one we're going to, Rosanna? The one in on July 1st. Crafternoon? I'm going to that one. Rosanna knows what ones I'm going to. I never know which ones they are. Um, so we have a little Marmite. <laughs> you should do a live knitting chat. You have to do it round here. If anyone wants to learn how to knit and you want to know, let me know. We'll do a, do a video. Yes, Holly, I'm going to the Hammersmith one. Rosanna's just told me. <laughs> so yeah, you come into that one. Alright, I'll put a clip on it. I've got some clips coming and I'll I'll come find me and I'll give it to you. So there's a little Marmite one. Um I've just finished these but they need glazing. So I have some little um Nutella. They don't always come out the same size, so it depends how much you like Nutella to what size jar you want. <laughs> Um, some more pumpkin. So this is the progression. So this was the older clay, and then we have um the the newer clay. So you can kind of see the the tone and and how they how they look. And Noel Fitzpatrick. Am I? I don't know what that is, honey. Am I just really stupid? Mum, you want a pizza one? All right, I'll have, I'll do some designs. So you can see the kind of difference. This one hasn't been glazed yet, so just imagine this one shiny. But um, but yeah, so they're them ones. Um, and what else do we have? Oh, we have who remembers these guys from Mario? This was last night I made these. The super vet. I'm okay at this, but I'm not that good, Holly, darling. <laughs> oh, it's Holly's husband, the super vet. You have to send me a picture of this guy now. Um, so, yeah, so we have a little guy from Mario. We have... I've made a load of these little stars. So we have all different kawaii faces. I was kind of experimenting with, like, eyebrows. Very smiley one there. Um, I've made a whole bunch of these stars. What's this one? There's a tiny little smile. That one there. And then... I don't know who's missing a face. I don't know what happened to that one. Different colours. You want a horseshoe, Mum? Yes, I'll do you one of those. Mum, where are you going to put them? You don't use your planner anymore. Why do you want them all? I'm going to have them all with me. I'm going to have some completely finished ones with me. And I just 
come raid me. Um, so that sounds wrong, doesn't it? Um, so another little face. I'm liking these stars because I make them in bulk. I'm trying to find my favourite one. I have a Joey Tribbiani star. Got to find him now. Please don't tell me he's the one that's lost his eyebrows because this one was the. Oh, here we go. Are you ready for Joey Tribbiani star? Oh, you do for when you're on your holiday. Showing off, mum. Um, I'm not selling selling them at the moment, Holly. This is the next part of this video of this live stream. Um, I'm kind of just making them and putting them out there for now. Um, I I kind of want to see what people think of them first before I start actually charging people, but they'll be free, so. Come and come and find me, and you can get some freebies. I don't know. I haven't got any idea. I, I we'll get to that. We'll get to that. But we have the Joey Tribbiani of stars. Now I did his eyebrows as if he's going. How are you doing? Love this little guy. <laughs> you can afford free. I think everyone can afford free. As you can tell, I was I was quite um influenced by friends. Mum gets hers free, of course you do, Mum. Um Yeah, I was kind of influenced by friends and I was chatting to Rosanna as I was making some ideas. So if you watch friends you'll know this. The chick and the duck. <laughs> I love them. These are glazed as well. Um, my phone's going off. Oh dear! Knock stuff off. But yeah, so these are the uh, chick and the duck. I love these two. What else have I done? Um, this guy is super cute. This is my little watermelon guy. Do a cat. I've not done a cat yet, Mum. I've done a... Where's he gone? I've done a koala. This is a bit of a bigger guy. I should do a tutorial on how to make them. Oh, I don't know about that, Holly darling. I don't know if I'm that good. I might do, like, the odd... I might do some tutorials on my Patreon, actually, because I don't know whether they're YouTube ready. But if you do want to know, I might put a couple of videos on Patreon for them. So here's my little koala guy. This guy took me ages. And this guy's not glazed and this was the old. So this is the newer clay. And then the older clay. Um I did this little guy. The koala's yours. Okay. <laughs> I will put a uh, a hook on him. And I will I'll put him in the holly pile. So here's a little the, and then I've been working on foxes because I've had a few requests for some foxes. So we have cubed fox. He kind of progressed different sizes. We have cubed fox. Foxed. Um, and then we have the flat one. Not too sure which ones. I, this one's glazed. This one's not glazed. So it looks a little bit different. But I don't know what version. Koala is your favourite animal. Oh, I didn't know that, darling. You can have the koala, babe. Um, there's my other fox over oh, there. Yeah, I don't know about these two. Foxes I've just found really hard to do. I think because they've got quite a few different colours on their faces. This guy's a little chubby one. Um, what was the other one? Who can tell me what film this is from? If you can tell, if you know, you get a free charm. <laughs> oh, it's all practice. I've been really practicing for months and months and months. I seriously recommend trying with like the really cheaper clays and just going and going and going. I have a lot that have not met, like, are in here that I've not shown yet. I will show you some of the disasters in a bit. <laughs> Rosanna is straight in there. She knows who this is. What well, who's this?
<laughs> so we have stars. I'll show you some of the fails, Holly, so you know that it's not all. This was a fail. This was supposed to be this. <laughs> it ended quite a lot bigger. So as you can tell, I, I, you know, what I mean, it's, it's, it's all kind of um, trial and error. Oh, we have a little octopus. Got to show you him. So, what do you guys think? Do you think, like, I, I'm kind of asking, would you like a shop? I don't know. Obviously, I'm going to still be giving. I'm going to give the first few out for free, but secretly modelled on you, isn't it? Obviously. Pirate charm. I will look into it. I normally, what I normally do is I do some sketches. If I show you, oh, let's go fall. Let's go fall. Um, if I show you, the back of my planner has actually been where I've been scratching, uh, scratching, sketching. I'm tired. I am so tired. Where's yeah? Oh. That's been ripped. So this is where I've been sketching some ideas. So I've had like ideas for different um planners. Um this is where the stacked planner came from. <laughs> oh, I'm really happy that you guys want to chat uh, want a um a shop. This was a pumpkin, obviously without the kawaii face. Um but yeah, anyone who is coming to the Nuneaton Planner P meetup in October, keep a little eye out for in your goodie bag because there might be a little sprinkle of me in there. <laughs> I'm not going to reveal anymore, but definitely keep, if you're going to that event, keep an eye out for that, for that goodie bag. Um, because so not the crafter noon that's coming up in July, the one in October. There's a little sprinkle of me in the in the goodie bags, but I don't know. I do want to do a shop. I just think it's more confidence kind of a thing that I don't that I haven't done it yet. I think I still I need to kind of get like a back catalogue of them. I need to wait for some more glaze as well. Anyone like an elephant? Are they still selling tickets? Um, Sweet Pea, that's it, Rosanna. Sorry, darling. I think it's sold out, Holly, but if you go on their Facebook group, you can be put on, like, a waiting list if any become available. Um, But, obviously, I can make my own charms, and obviously I will be getting a goodie bag. So, my, char my charm that will be in my goodie bag, um, I will give away. So, keep an eye out on here, Holly, or my Instagram, and you may win the charm. I should make Barney. Oh, I used to love Barney. I'd have to do that. I went a little bit crazy with the um with the uh, dusting spray. Dusting spray? Dusting powder on these. So yeah, that's one of the big things I wanted to talk to you guys about on this uh stream about oh possibly opening a charm shop. Hashtag buy all the charms. Oh, I love that. Hashtag buy all the Gemero's craft charms. What is that one? I also, also want to talk to you guys about um, an idea that myself and the wonderful Stephen, my husband, um, had. You can see me in the background. That's so distracting. Let's go put that over there. I've just realised. One second. Oh, destroyed my front room. Over there. Okay. So yeah. So uh, an idea. Will you be an Etsy shop? I believe so. I'm not too sure. I will obviously let you guys know when I know. <laughs> you will be raiding them. I hope you will be. I am very. Um nervous about opening a shop I think because obviously you've got to have the confidence in your own 
your own stuff. Uh, but yes, yeah, so something I want to talk to you guys about as well, it's a different, kind of a different idea, but along the same lines, um, is something that I've been planning or working out with. The hubster, Stephen, he um, had an idea for a, not so much a company, but like a, a, a something else to sell on my shop if I do open a shop for the charms. And that is merch, merch, merch. That's a good idea, as I I might just sell on my Facebook page. I think I will actually do that because obviously I don't. I'd rather do like custom charms rather than just making a load. I'd rather just sell them on the Facebook group and then people can go, I want this, 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 and this. I might do that. Good idea, Rosanna. I'm going to have to, like, hire you as, like, a PR lobster charm. I have actually done some sketches for a lobster charm, Holly. I just need to um, finalise them and then and start figuring out how to, to make it. Because, obviously, the clay <laughs> the clay doesn't normally behave uh, if, you don't, if you don't do it well. A friend's lobster. Oh, yes. I should do like two lobsters like that, shouldn't I? I do have a Facebook page, Holly darling. It's just Gemma Rose Crafts. It's a it's a separate Facebook page for my channel. So if you uh um search for it on Facebook, you should be able to find it. Have just spider. Mum's just coming up with all the ideas. Yeah, two lobsters like this. I might have to do redo the sketches, but I think I might I might do that. Like a subtle hint to friends. Um but yeah, so me and Stephen Awesome Holly. Me and Stephen have been looking at not so much merch as in like stuff with my logo all over it, because I don't think people would want to wear that. But I'm thinking a more along the lines of like planner t shirts. Stephen's really good at designing. He's got like a whole thing on his computer that he designed stuff with. He was designing like wrestling t-shirts and stuff with his friend, but we've kind of um gone down the line of I don't know anywhere that really sells planner t-shirts. And obviously you can I think you can get like UKPA ones, but um I'm kind of thinking more along the lines of like generic planner t-shirts. So just like I don't know, planner babe or some really cool kind of planner quote or something. Um, me and Stephen were coming up to, with some really, really cool quotes last night. <laughs> yes, Rosanna, I only wear t-shirts with your face on. So uh, we're going to look at doing some designing and he's graphic, like, doing all the graphic designs for him and stuff. I'm kind of inputting um, like he kind of, there was a design that we come up with that has an actual picture of a planner on it. And I said to him, oh, well, you need to get, um, you know, all the planners. And he said, what? I was like, you know, there's like different types of planner and people are going to want their type of planner, i.e. like ring band, TNs, um, all that kind of stuff. Um, you need to put, people are going to want their planner that they use on a t-shirt. And, uh he was just flabbergasted. So I think I'm going to come with that kind of insider knowledge of the planner world to help him. Happy planners. Yes. Erin Condren's. So, or like a, a, a kind of mock-up of what an Erin Condren would be. But I kind of, yeah, I'm kind of thinking we're, we're going to do it. Um, obviously, he's been at work all day today and he's at work uh, tomorrow and Saturday so probably Sunday going into Monday we'll start looking at some designs so if you are on the Facebook group I will be posting some kind of sneak peeks or some teasers in there next week of what he's designed. It did show me one design yesterday that was really really cool um I kind of he showed me it and like he I didn't even know he was like already designing we'd kind of just been throwing back some ideas and stuff and he he yeah he definitely had a really cool idea and this this t-shirt looks incredible so I really hope that you guys are going to enjoy that so I just wanted to get your feedback and obviously if you're watching this video obviously after the stream please let me know in the comments below 
if you would like plan t-shirts as well because that's kind of what this whole opening shop and the charms thing is gonna be <laughs> it sounds good to me but Zana's just gonna be standing outside my front door with like a a giant suitcase ready to take everything home so I have been talking for a very long time now what would you like me to craft I have two kids upstairs that have not gone to sleep yet I can hear um, I have watercolour stuff down here and clay stuff so what would you like me to be doing you can be <laughs> yes I will pay you to be a living advert I will pay you in waffles and pasta apparently because <laughs> that's all I cook when you turn around You want to see clay? Okay, okay. Let's get let's move the keyboard. I don't know why that's in front of me. I've not been using it. What should I make? To be fair, I am running low on clay. I have ordered some more. Shh! Don't tell Stephen. <laughs> Even though I did have some more come today. Oh. Yeah. Where do you sign? I'll draw you up a contract. I'll make you a contract with clay. Yeah, I bought some more white clay today because that's all I had left. But they're like really cheap to pick up off Amazon. If you do want to try and get this clay, I've shopped around and looked around many different places. Hobbycraft do do it, so you can get it from, from Hobbycraft. But if you want it quick, Amazon. I ordered this yesterday afternoon. And it came this morning. Monthly direct debit. <laughs> Horseshoe. I've not done any sketches for that mother, so I don't know. Um, I don't think I've got any grey either. Oh, I do have. I do have grey, but not a lot. Let me make up some. Some grey, and then we'll um we'll go from there. Right, I need some. Is that black? What I do is a good tip if you're gonna get into clay. I've got obviously this here. I'm just gonna hold, and I try and use like a plasticky kind of um container, and any extra tiny little bits that would all like some people just like put together, or you might lose. I just stick. To the side so they come in handy for like little eyes or little little details egg and chips on a plate is that your is that how much you're charging to be my walking talking advert or do you want that as a charm happy planner charm i'm gonna have to sketch it out first holly babes but i will do it i've lost my black plate where did i just put that oh it's there i didn't take it out okay you do have to give it a bit of squeeze to get it that's uh, this is gonna sound really wrong now isn't it where's oh where's is my knife oh, in here. this is all my kind of metally stuff in here so i have like little cookie cutters and stuff there's a lot in here i'm gonna try it's like a little, little bunny again amazon <laughs> what i'm looking for this this is a best friend when you're doing clay okay Holly I will do some sketches in a sec and see do you know what I haven't seen a happy planner in so long yes Rosanna you do live under the desk if no Mia's been under there today getting some stuff for school so it's a bit messy Clover oh you would say that. Where's it gone? I did make a four leaf clover, but it didn't come out too. I don't know if I want to show you this now because it's kind of embarrassing. It didn't come out too well. I want to do it again. But there's a little sneak. That's who kicked me. Yes, Rosanna. 
She was under there for a while getting some stuff for school. This is these are um this was the old clay, so I've not tried it with the new clay, so I will do one. I'll make you one on this stream. But that's kind of what they will that that would look like. You have great minds, right. You just need to move this over. Another good tip for clay, make sure you have a glass or a glass like bottom. So if you can't see this table you're on is actually glass. Just cutting off some white clay. Make some grey. Yeah, it does take a long time. When you when it's not big they call it working. So when you you first start working with it and warming it up, it, it takes a little while, especially when you're trying to mix colours. Let's see how this you'll see how this goes. I think I'm gonna need some more white. Not enough white in there. This is why I go through so much. I don't have a grey clay yet. This is gonna be the whole taking screenshots of Gemma pulling fully faces funny faces trying to get this clay to work now. The kids are still awake. Can you hear that banging? How are you all? This looks so weird. I'm trying to make keep this in shot so you know what I'm actually doing. Might have been you, Bank. Rosanna, would you keep it down? <laughs> Who votes for um having a stream with Rosanna in and trying to get Rosanna to do clay work? You know it's gonna be funny when you try and teach me how to knit. My mum will tell you the story of that. She started me with like ten stitches and when I finished the row I ended up with twenty. So I can't knit, so that's going to be a cool video as well. Me trying to learn how to knit. I'm vibrating. I do actually need to turn. I'm actually going to remember now to turn an alarm off that I've got coming up. Yeah, this is like really soft now, so I'm just working the... You kind of get in what colour it's going to be. Tablet time in 11 minutes, I know. I took them early. I took them just before I did the stream. Because um, I didn't want to be popping pills live on air. <laughs> so I would take them, as I promise I've taken them. Yes, Rosanna should join in. <laughs> Good luck, Rosanna. <laughs> You're not going to get me knitting. I can't do it. I know, I'm a rebel, aren't I? Okay, so we've kind of got that mixed. To so make sure that it's mixed, you just kind of pull it and then you'll see if there's any kind of marbling. So that's kind of mixed. How am I going to make this into a horseshoe now? I don't even know what a horseshoe looks like. I do. I've got a tattoo of it on my shoulder, but you know what I mean. Um, Let me get a picture up. Um, horse shoe. Okay, right. So I'm thinking. Can you hear my kids? Yeah, Rosanna, you know what that means. I'm thinking like that kind of idea but I'm gonna put a face on it or do you not want a face on it mum? Like uh I'm try to find one that's got a kawaii face. Like a little face like on this guy. Let me know. Knitting with added interest. 
No face. Okay. What charms next? First person to comment gets the next charm. <laughs> Just on this one. I need to keep that picture up. I don't know what I'm doing here. Okay. I've not sketched this at all, so I've got no idea how this is. This is going to be fun, isn't it? Well, I'm thinking rolling it out. Try not to wobble the camera too much. There you go, Holly. Next one's going to be a clover. I'm guessing you don't want my hair in it, mother. <laughs> a little piece of me. Um, I've made way too much clay. Anyone got anything grey they want? Tell kids nanny is here and tell them to be quiet. <laughs> it's not going to work, is it, Mum? <laughs> be honest. No, I don't think that's thick enough. DNA free with every cap. You can make your own Gemma. No. An elephant. Oh, I do. Oh. I made a purple elephant. Why did I make a purple elephant? Why did I make a purple I don't know why I made a purple elephant. Maybe because I didn't have enough to make grey. I don't know why I made a purple one. Right, I'm just figuring out. Okay. I will show you what I've done when I've finished. Shaping. Ooh. It's, oh god. So that's kind of the size, Mum, at the minute. I need to put some details in it, obviously. Turn the insides in a bit more. We'll do it smaller. Ooh. I need to put this straight on the baking sheet, I think. Um, an elephant after too much <laughs> bigger. bigger like what like really I think this is fine mum need to make it like Thick or it will snap. It's a good tip as well. Don't let your charms snap. I have had some decapitations, as you can tell, uh, from doing the clay too thin. My kids drive me mad. I can hear them. So all I'm doing now is making like a another one to put on top and then I'll do some this is actually an easier charm Ooh. has anyone been doing anything else craft related we've got clay making and knitting going on is anyone actually crafting whilst I'm doing this, or are you just watching me be a tit? Don't answer that one, Mum, because I know what your answer is going to be. Oh, uh, more hair. Why am I molting? Might be because I um, put the hair dye in yesterday. Not that you can tell. Yeah, you've been making pizzas, Mum, I know that. Oh, Holly. You are sweet. Why is the shape of this weird? It kind of doesn't look like a horseshoe anymore. So I put some details in. I need... This and this. I don't I haven't bought like any of the 
any of the uh the proper like clay making tools i just have an old pencil of this which was from one of the kids play-doh sets that they've lost all the play-doh to <laughs> so um yeah i don't i'm not like the conventional crafter anyone from this like if you watch this channel you'll know so I don't like to spend money on tools that I know that I've got something that can do the same sort of thing at home. Like some of the tools for the, doing this clay making. Hi newcomers! Yeah, some of the tools from this craft making are so expensive. It is unreal. And I'm like, I have a pencil and an old plastic tool from a kid's toy. It's fine. Ooh. There we go. And then this was. I think my kids are actually play fighting upstairs now. We hear tears, we know what's happened. You're new to the channel. Hi, how do I pronounce your name? Uh, um, um, Dad? I'm really sorry if I've said that wrong. But welcome to the craziness that is my channel. We're all friendly here, we're just a little bit mad. Right, Mum, do you want it as a charm or as a cue? If you don't know what's happening, I'm... I got it correct. Oh, thank you. Um, if you don't know what we're doing, well, I'm, ma I'm making clay charms for people in the, uh, in the, in the comments. Um... Because they they had a they had a vote and they picked clay charms. Yeah, mum, keyring or 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 like kind of clip. I'm thinking you're gonna want a keyring because you don't use planner. Uh, <laughs> the lady that said Betty is my mother. Keyring. But yeah. Ginger cat and a black cat. Okay. I did make a cat. I'll show you that in a minute. Just finishing off mum's horse, horse, horse shoe. And then. Right now, I've got to do these. God, Mum, how many charms do you want? <laughs> right. Okay. Hopefully, this doesn't. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait a minute. Stay. So mum, oh god, can you see, obviously it looks a bit weird because it's not been baked yet, I've got to put it in the oven, but I will give this to you at some point, I need to put some glaze on it first, there you go, so Holly, you want a um, clover, do you have a preference in shade of green? Or oh, don't deny. I've got 10 million different shades of green. <laughs> Is that okay, Mum? I've got to bake it and glaze it, so hopefully it should be okay. I'll give it to you at some point this week. Or on Sunday. I know it's for Granddad, Mum. I have two tattoos on my back that tell me it's for my Granddad. Uh. Yeah. Dark green. Okay. Let's have a little look here. I don't know why I did that voice. Okay, so I'm gonna start with this green, but I'm gonna add I'm gonna add some shiznies to it. Where's it gone? Who's gonna be next? 
to shout out something and I will try my damnedest as you can see for mums and then after I'll if I see you at an event or I will post this is how this stream's gonna go I've left where have I used no no I've not made a guinea pig for Fran yet yet I'm actually sketch sorry to see what's on TV sketching some here's the cat that you want to say I had a little bit of dark blue left and a little bit of the old black clay left and I kind of mixed it and it kind of went a bit wrong but this is the cat that I made you put you press the red button like, thank you sweetie very kind of you yes all the uh, thumbs up are helping my channel so if you can if you don't mind if you're watching just put a little little thumbs up helps people see this video and my channel oh he's been decapitated I've just realised he's missing an ear oh. oh no oh that's not nice he was glazed as well this is this is the, the, the cheaper clay so that's why it's um it's done that thank you so yeah so that's the cat right let's make this dark oh my god I'm like I need some black clay. Also, I got a really cool clay the other day. It's like a gran glittery granite one. Not had anything to use for that one yet. So, give us some ideas. And uh, where's my... I've lost... Oh, it's over there. That's why. You pressed the light. Thank you. The bunny and the cat were fighting. Yes, Rosanna. You know... I've got a few decapitated ones in here. There's, there's another one in here somewhere that's been that was decapitated by my, my by my daughter. Mia decided to glitter with clay. I tell you what, when you start looking at clay, it's like a slippery slide down. Like you think buying scrapbooking stuff is crazy. Try looking at clay. There's like pearled ones and translucent ones. So there's ones that are like. They start off like like this, like opaque, and then they go like a, a clear kind of translucent colour when they're baked. They look awesome. So I've 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 kind of earmarked some of those for Mother's Day, um, from the kids. But um yeah. There's some really cool clays out there. So I'm just checking to see what the hell has just come on my TV. I just see Will Smith. I can hear my kids upstairs. This is a lot darker than I thought it was gonna be. Need some more green. Creating a whole new colour for you, Holly. You have a stash of fire Fimo. Fimo? I still don't know how to say that. And you don't show me these things, Holly? I'm insulted. Glittery stars, yes, yes. I'm gonna have to make this last. I actually have a, a a cookie cutter in that that I made them all from. They may be my next. No one's claimed the next charm. Who wants the next charm? The secret is out. Yeah, Holly, how could you do this to me? If you need anyone to make anything with it, or you know, <laughs> I'd be like your. You're paying me in clay. <laughs> we need a clay date at Holly's. You have a stash of everything, Holly. Do you have a stash of me? Do you have clones of me? I don't know what I'm saying. You need to tidy the floor. You don't want to see what my flat looks like behind this camera and behind the lighting. I'm choosing to ignore it. <laughs> it's glowing so hard. <gasps> you get finger ache after a while. Yeah, you really don't need to tidy, honey. 
Rosanna knows that from coming around so bad things. <laughs> Lego and naked Barbies everywhere. Not mine, just so you know. <laughs> you know, the kids. Oh, this dark green's taken. It's, why couldn't you just have light green? <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Rosanna's got to clone me. Rosanna wishes she had a clone. Look, it's dying my fingers green. That's another thing. I need to start using gloves when I'm mixing these. It's an obstacle course. Makes it a challenge. I build an obstacle course so I can't get to my fridge. Oh, my fingers are clicking now. I see me working out. This is about the st most strenuous workout ever. It's slowly mixing. That's a really strange colour. I don't quite like that. Let's mix it more and see how it goes. You should see my desk, Holly. Pretty much like that. I have so much, like, what do you people, you guys do with scrap paper? Because, like, I have so much like scraps it's unreal and I haven't bought like apart from the papers that I sometimes get with a lot of those paper kits I haven't bought any new real paper pads so I don't understand where this paper is just sitting there right is that an okay colour um, Holly or would you like me to try and use the old clay which I'm not too keen on or just use the lighter green. This is the only thing you can't see it. <laughs> I've got like a, a shoe box that I had like a pile of scraps in. I was like, yeah. And then I was like, oh, I need another box for stuff like tissue paper and stuff like that. And then, um, and then I was like, oh, I need another box for like little scraps. And then I've for somehow I've developed into like eight boxes of just mi mismatch of God knows what in. Okay, Holly, right, well, I'm gonna start doing this then. You've done no knitting today, Mum. Shocking. <laughs> you can have a night off. You've had a stressful day by the sounds of it. Did you fall in work? Or was it on the way home? Do I have to start coming to get you from work now? Yes, mother. You need to slow down. Four leaf clover, Holly, or three leaf? I'm turning green. I've made this great big lump of green glow and I'm going to use that amount. This is where it's good that it doesn't air dry so you can just use it another day. Four please, okay. <laughs> I am about to do a Hulk smash, look at that. That's crazy. I've not. I, this is the first clay that's done that though, so it's alright. Stephen's gonna come home and think I've gone off. <laughs> oh, mum, you are a silly, aren't you? Did Dad meet you? Sorry guys, I know obviously this is my stream, but my mum fought, fell over. Don't make her angry. <laughs> you know, the only thing that makes me angry, Rosanna. Lack of relentless. 
Do you know how prepared I am? This is like a quarter full. And then I bought an extra one over just in case. <laughs> and I have a multitude of snacks and stuff. Is anyone else having anything to drink? Good, I'm glad Dad met you. Be careful, Mum. <laughs> Zana knows money. The thing is that my in my defence when it comes to the relentless and stuff, I don't drink alcohol, I'm teetotal. I don't drink coffee, I don't drink tea. The only small pleasure I don't smoke obviously, I have is my relentless. Natalie likes her Pepsi Max. I don't mind Pepsi Max. It's not. It's not with us. It's normally either Relentless or Diet Dr Pepper. That's another favourite. You okay, Natalie? You've been a little bit quiet, my lovely. Not that that's a problem, but just want to make sure you're okay, Mum. Do you want me to make you a purple charm to match? When you're off next, Mum, I'll come in and see you. I mean, you only live like two seconds down the corner. It's not like I need a bus. Pepsi. Pepsi Max is a popular one. It always seems to be on offer as well. Seems to be like it's, it's not... Right, let's start shaping these. Um, yeah, I'll use that one. So all I'm doing, I've made four little balls, and these are going to become the leaves, hopefully. You're multitasking. Are we allowed to know what else you're doing? Are you crafting? I'm, I'm streaming slash making charms slash children wrangling. I can hear them upstairs, they're playing the Lego. It's only World Book Day in their school tomorrow, so I'm pretty sure they'll be fine. I'm turning more and more green. It's going to get to a point where I'm going to film a video and just have like green streaks or like green hands. You're 30 miles away from your craft supplies. Oh, no, that's, that is a injustice right there. Why are you so far away? Are you like me? If you had a row with your craft stuff, I have. They don't like me because I don't tidy up after them. Me, you know what I mean. My, my desks aren't talking to me at the moment. I've not seen them in a little while. Buried crap. To be honest, I when I obviously do my haul videos um, on here, I can't use the stuff until I've filmed it. And there's only certain parts of the week that I can film. I.e. Pr pretty much on the days that Stephen's at work. And I don't know if anyone like, coming around or anything else to do. Or on a Sunday when me lovely mum has the kids. So if I buy stuff like stash wires, I can't film it. So it just kind of sits on my desk. But because it sits on my desk, it looks messy. And then I don't I don't want to film because I have to tidy up. Do you see this logic? <laughs> and like I don't know what any ideas on like how I can keep the uh, the new stuff separate and it's not just piling on my desk. Yes, mum, pop round tomorrow for lunch. Oh, I see. You're coming round when you know my food shop's turned up. She's not stupid, everyone. Craft supplies are stroppy teenagers. If you don't tidy up the desk area, they're like, no. We may look pretty, but we're not going to work for you until you tidy up. 
you're 30 seconds away from your stash. I, well, it depends how fast I walk to going upstairs. I don't like how this is going. I need to do some more work. You need pampering, Mum. I'm sure you do. I'm sure I can stretch to making you a lunch. Um, Holly, do you want a kawaii slash face on a said charm? Or are you okay with it just being whatever you want? Oh, okay, Nancy. How's it going? Did you not, like, have, like, a small... Even, like, a, a small, like, notebook and, like, a little watercolour set with you during the week? Could that not be an option? Keep it simple. Okay, right, I'm just going to sort out the... Uh, How it's looking. Makes it a bit easier so I can kind of... All I'm doing now is just blending it all together. One side of this it's just not going how I want it to go and it's starting to annoy me. Gemma Holt smash is about to come out if this charm doesn't play doesn't do what it's supposed to do. But yeah is that not a, an, a, an option for you Nancy just to have like a just a notebook and even just some watercolour pencils and like where's my brushes? Um, obviously clean but one of these kind of watercolour brushes with it just so you can kind of get a little bit of creativity out maybe of an evening like as a de-stress and obviously you're probably extremely busy but it might be nice If I keep looking at my watch, I've got my notifications going through. Right, this charm is starting to behave. I think it heard me threaten it with the Hulk smashing. Right, keyring or charm, Holly, darling. The clips are turning up. You'll get these at the event um, in July. Or I may post them. Send me your address and I'll post them. I thought, Natalie, and then... You can um, do a little bit of creativeness while you're there. Charm, okay. Finally, we do dads. Oh, I've got one there. Where are we? Why am I asking you guys? Let me know what I'm doing. It's right that I've stolen these from Stephen. I have such a runny nose. I do apologise. I'm under. I've brought my lighting down from upstairs. But the thing is, where I've got my um, curtains open on my balcony, if anyone in the flat opposite are looking in, they're like, what is this woman doing? First of June. Why am I saying July? Did I put June? Thing is, though, Rosanna, how many times have I asked you when this event is? He's not booked it yet anyway. So if I have got it wrong, no, I've got it in, look, June 1st, I just um, was saying July, but it's in June 1st. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to put the, where put that, I know. Who wants the next charm? Because this, I'm going to show you this, Holly, in just a sec. I'm just going to put the, uh, 
you bake them with the actual charm things in and then after they're baked you take them back out and then fix them in properly you have to make sure that that's in where it's supposed to be yep that's in fine just going to neaten it out and then I'll show you. What's my favourite type of craft? Um, It's kind of been fluctuating a little bit because obviously I've started doing these charms. Um, But I probably think along the kind of relaxa rela relaxation, because that's a word, relaxation can't speak um kind of a way to relax kind of thing is probably would be watercolors um obviously i've got my new babies so i do a lot of this um just sitting on the side front it really helps especially when i'm trying to keep my mind off of pain and stuff but i have oh dear i have what's the word wilted away wilted Whittled, whittled away many hours doing the charms the last I think it, it differs it all the time it depends on how much I can move around obviously if I can move and get to my desk it's definitely like scrapbooking and, and stuff like that if I can't really move then it is more kind of watercoloring and charm making and stuff um Mum wants a teddy bear, okay. A ball of knitting wool. Oh, I'll try that. Right. You ready, Holly? Obviously, it'll be a slightly different colour, slightly different shade of green um, when it's baked. I'm nervous now. Um, and then, obviously, I will glaze it for you and have it all ready. Just... There's... There's yours. I hope you like it. Obviously, that's where the charm's going to go in. The When it's baked, that silver bit will come out. Um, the clip will then go on, and then it will be fastened back in with some super glue um, or some stronger glue. Uh, but it's in there. It's not, it's not even in there straight, but it's in there just to hold that hole to make sure that it doesn't bake closed. Um, so, yeah, so there's your, there's your um, clover. Oh, I'm glad you're enjoying it, darling. Uh, oh, I'm glad you like it, Ollie. Yes, I did complain about the surgeon. Well, I've put, I've started the complaint. I've emailed. There's a certain people. It was a comment on the um, health update I did. That um, yeah, a certain what was it? Yeah, there's a certain people that that take complaints about certain doctors in certain hospitals, and I have emailed them so waiting to hear back so I'll let you guys know when I know pretty even what's pretty even oh what the charm <laughs> I was like what um what sort of what sort of videos do you do more kind of scrapbooking and planning and crafting and chatting and I do a lot of health updates so I've got a lot of health stuff going on Yes, Natalie. I'm trying to remember who it was that put that comment up. But yes, I've um, sent an email. So I, I believe it's the right people. Um, if not, I'm going to make a phone call. Yes, I'm going to try and see if I can get a second opinion. Um, you do shopping hauls. Okay. I will come and uh, come and check you out. Right, am I starting this knitting ball, a doodad? What colour? What's your favourite colour wool to knit with? Take a swig of whatever you're drinking because I'm running out of air. Why do I always wear, wear red lipstick on these streams as well? It dries me out.
Mom wants pink. Holly wants pink. Are you going to be the odd one up, Rosanna? <laughs> you can pick a different colour if you want. Where's my pink? Do you want like this kind of pink, which is like a hot pink, or do you want a light pink? You're always odd. Well, right, Holly wants bright pink, so I'll break off some for Holly in that colour. Multicolour. I can try and do a multicolour one if you want, Rosanna. Mum wants light pink. Okay, let me just mix some white in. I can try and do a multicolour for you, Rosanna. What kind of colours, though? Because I, I can make, like, long strings and then twist them. I can light pink. Oh, I should have washed the green off. It's okay. Oh, dear. So what do you guys think of this new streaming... Um, why I'm doing it. Does it look any different or is it better or is it worse or I'm more than happy to go back to the, the live chat kind of one. Any colours will do. I'm so clever. Rosanna, you know me better than that. <laughs> um, But yeah, I am going to be hopefully setting up a sh shop for these. See, this is what I mean. This is the older the not so not cheap clay, but it's kind of the cheaper clay, and it's very sticky. You like the streaming, okay? Well, I'm gonna just mix a bit more. Where's my white? I lost. Oh, there we go. Okay, as long as it's looking good. Oh dear, hair in it now. I promise you, I will not give you a charm that's got my hair in unless you want it. I know, I know you do, Rosanna. Um, but yeah, I am going to be hopefully doing this in some sort of a shop and then doing the, the planner t-shirts as well. Um, but I am going to be sending these first, apart from obviously you guys that have got these live, um, to my Patreons. So if you're a Patreon and you're watching this, keep an eye out for your package this month because you will get in a, is it exclusive? Yeah, kind of an exclusive charm that I've not made, I'm not going to be making for the shop or anywhere else. So Patreons will get exclusive charms that I will only make for Patreons each month, along with their normal packages. So obviously depending on what tier, depends on um, what package you get. Like some, some of them just get postcards, but all Patreons will get um, a charm, which is the only thing. I need to put it on the actual... I haven't updated my Patreon since. A knitted Gemma is what we need. Yes! Rosanna, knit me. There's a there's a challenge for you and me, Mum. Knit me. Glasses and all. This is so sticky. Right, I'm gonna leave that over there to kind of cool down a bit. So I will start with Mum's first. You need a pack what kind of package, Rosanna? <laughs> no. Uh yeah.
can't remember, you know what, I can't even remember what my own tears are. But now I have a two dollar, I think it's two dollar, five dollar, eight dollar and ten I believe. <laughs> Rosanna, you bad influence, you. <laughs> no. Um. I'm the one that's a bad influence from Rosanna. She didn't know that you could have waffles delivered to your house until she'd met me. <laughs> I know the ways to get food. Um, but yes, so I am working... What one? I haven't finished the exclusive charms yet, the new glazing. But yeah, so each month Patreons will be getting exclusive charms. So shameless plug. If you hover over the screen, I don't know if it's the same on if you're on like a tablet or something watching this or your phone. If you touch the screen, you might see it. But the top right hand corner, there's a clickable icon. If you click in there, it will take you to my Patreon page. So if you did want to even Patreon to just get one exclusive charm you will get one because they will not be released on the shop fictional shop that's not open yet i am looking at some new logo designs as well which are being designed for me so there's that as well you're old and in need of waffles rosanna there's there will be a waffle here waiting when you come round. right so i'm just gonna use some when you're doing something like a ball, um, because obviously I'm going to do like a knitted ball, so it's going to be like a string, you need, I kind of am going to use like a, a base, so it's going to be like a, a colour that's not going to show up too much, um, but because I don't have much of that pink, I'm just going to use grey. I'm going to start off with like a little grey ball and then wrap the wool round. Okay, see, see you another time. Um, Jack, I think that's how you say that. Uh, thank you for coming in. I'm really sorry. I'm burping away now. It's this drink. Thanks for joining us, sweetie. Okay. So this is going to be my base, and then I'm going to wrap, hopefully, wrap the wall, wall round. It also lets the, it gives it something for it to, the charm to stick into if you want charms. my concentration now <laughs> I do apologize guys oh this is so weird I'm trying to wrap this round you do like to challenge me Rosanna don't you Because the stream is a little bit further behind what I'm actually doing, you're about two seconds behind. I keep looking up and see my god awful expression on my face when I'm trying to concentrate, it's really distracting. I think the kids are asleep now. Can't hear them. Will you go over there? Thank you. This is the start of my knitting training, yeah. I just get I don't understand how I end up with more stitches than I started with. I never forget the look on my mum's face. And I handed her this hodgepodge of knitting back to her. I don't know if this is gonna work. <laughs> I 
Oh, they miss you too, Mum. See them Sunday. Don't know how this clay is going to react. Because this this is the um I don't have pink in the Fimo clay, so this is the tiger clay and it doesn't like warm fingers very well. <laughs> it would be a scarf would become a rug, Rosanna, that's true. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not feeling this charm, guys. I'm not liking it. I don't like this clay. I might have to make you pick a different colour. Oh, I might actually make my own pink. Because this clay is just not reacting well to this. I'm going to abandon ship. Abandon ship. And I'm going to mix. I'm going to mix some Fimo pink. That's what I'm going to do. Because I'm not, I'm not happy with how that one's turned out. This is the thing you'll see in my life fails as well. Let's get some proper pink on there. Yes, I would be good at a fishnet, Mum. You're right. Is your string vest sorted? Yes, Rosanna. Only when you come and see me, though, obviously. Oh dear, so oh, you'll see me mixing clay again now. <laughs> so, yeah, has anyone else kind of like found a new craft where they're like, oh. And uh, got into something completely new. Because for me it was just scrapbooking and planning for just so long. And then I kind of dabbled, I kind of started dabbling in other stuff. And it's really fun. <laughs> Sounds so fun with a string vest and a waffle. Sounds like a normal Friday night for you, love. You need to bathe your arms soon. I am going to do these charms. And then I will probably jump off because um husband will be home soon <laughs> we know how to have a good time Rosanna don't worry try to think of another way to do this ball of wool I think I mean it worth starting with one or what? I don't know. Anyone got ideas of how to kind of construct this? Right, I've made a better pink now. So this is the light pink and then obviously I will make it brighter for um for Polly. Thanks mum. Don't make me cry live on camera. People don't need to see that. Oh, that's a good idea, Rosanna. Making a ball and then cutting it to make it look like wool. Okay. Oh, okay. This is why Rosanna's like my PR person. <laughs> she comes up with the idea. It's not so much it's just like the execution I can do, I just need the idea. And then I know what I'm doing. Okay. So we have and then I might actually take a little bit off coming off it so it's like the, the like little wind bit. That's a good idea, Holly as well. I'm gonna try this one and then if it don't work I'll try Holly's idea. 
unfortunately a little slice in my finger now live on camera. <laughs> Is it really with knitting? Finding the loose end. I I'm like that with double sided tape. Not just knitting. Seeing the concentration face come out again. Yeah. Oh! It's become one with the sofa. Fine, it's fine. Where was I? I was here. Ah, Mum, you'll know what that is. A pair of knitting needles, I could do. The amount of times we've been sat in my mum's house and like it'll all go quiet and mum's knitting and you'll just see a ball of wool emerge because she's dropped it off the chair and it's rolled along the floor. <laughs> it's always fun. Makes me laugh sometimes if mum starts making something and she falls out of love with it or doesn't like it. She'll obviously start again and unravel it all. But you'll see like this ball of wool that like has four different colours on it. So it's quite fun unwrapping. It's like a giant parcel parcel. Try to see what colours are underneath. I have asked mum to knit me a planner pouch. You remember mum? Haven't seen it yet. Okay, and then this needs to be thinner. Oh, it looks like a mouse at the moment, I'm not going to lie. A5, what's the measurements of an A5 planner, Rosanna? Right. Um, I've done Mum's light pink one. I'm just gonna make this darker pink and then um do Holly's quickly. It's like the um the bullet journal A five. Oh, I need to mix that over the wrong thing then. Dark pink. I'm 
this okay, Holly? Oh, I wish someone else would mix this clay together for me, though. Thanks, Rosanna. I did get this as well. This cool little... It makes roses. I've not made one yet. But it looks pretty cool. So, who did um, World Book Day this week? Kids or just generally dressing up? My two are doing this tomorrow. Uh, sneak peek, obviously. Mia's obviously being Belle. She was Belle or Beauty last year and was devastated that her dress might not fit her, but it fits her fine. Um, and then... I do need a rose charm on my planner, Rosanna. You would make a good yellow? What? Um, oh, yellow pages. <laughs> um, but yeah, that is not pink at all. Don't know if I can get on pink here because that bright pink is just not working um what was I saying yeah so Mia's gonna be Belle her dress still fits bless her and we didn't know what to make William because last year I made I made the decision for him and he was a Dalmatian I had to lie to my son and tell him that I'd rubbed off the bit of makeup I'd put on his nose um it was only until he got home from school that he realised I hadn't actually taken it off and he hated me for the rest of the day. Um, so yeah, so this year I gave him a choice of what he could be and so he is being a policeman. Don't know what book that's in, but he picked it. There was like Paw Patrol, like it was on Amazon obviously, but there was like Paw Patrol and... Um, like Spider Man was on there and everything. No, nope, wanted to be a policeman. So he is going to look freaking adorable in the morning. Someone in work dressed up as an Oompa Loompa. <laughs> I love that. Right. Is that an okay colour? Um. Holly, I can't do a bright pink yet. I have got pink clay coming, so I can make you a more pink one then if you'd rather that. But this is the kind of colour that I've got coming from these two colours at the moment. Quick. <laughs> okay, right, let me do your ball of wool. And then I need to do a mixture for Rosanna. The wrong size, <laughs> but yeah, no. So William's gonna be a policeman. That's what he wanted. So, um, yeah. I can't actually wait. Mia's asked for makeup as well in the morning. So guess. What muggins has to get her up earlier to do her makeup? I wouldn't trust her dad to do it. I will, mum. I'll send pictures. I forgot to take pictures last year. I was devastated. So, oh no, I did get a picture of William, but that's only because he went into nursery at midday. Um, yeah, pictures will be going on Instagram. Yes, scrapbook page. If anyone has seen any police related scrapbook items, I don't think you have. Or I know that there's a Beauty and the Beast range somewhere. Tell me I'm not I've not imagined that. I'm pretty sure I've seen Beauty and the Beast. Them I know there's a Disney set. I've seen the Disney um set. 
but I'm pretty sure there's a beauty in the beast set because I think someone linked me to it. Please let me know if you, if I'm not making that. Mum, I can print them here. I have the uh, Canon selfie, so I can print them here. I don't pay to get them printed, Mum. Come and use your daughter's printer. Why am I putting on an accent? This is how you know I'm tired. Very tired. I don't know if you can see what I'm doing here. Okay. I think that's okay. Oh dear. I tell you what, using this knife on camera is not good. <laughs> That's a good idea, Rosanna. Some black and white square paper. See, this is why I... <laughs> I mean, I love Rosanna anyway, but she's just so full of ideas. When uh, Muggins here doesn't have a clue. If I need an idea for something, I'm like, Rosanna! Grains! Okay. Right, Mum and um, um, Holly, sorry darling, charms or uh, queuings. And then I'm just going to do Rosanna's multicoloured. Anyone else want a charm whilst I'm sitting here? Or do you want me to do what colour? I'm going to jump off here in... A hot second. Let's see what am I doing? Do this one. This one. And this one. Well, I'm just grabbing colours to do multicoloured look. I make myself a little brain charm. <laughs> Rosanna, I have just ordered a waffle like this, but like a waffle mould. So that will be a that will be another charm. Mum wants a key ring and Holly wants a charm. Let me just remember these and put these in. Looks like I'll be sticking the oven on in a sec. Jabby Dodger. I've seen like an Oreo mould, which is really cool. Who's? Mum's was a light pink, wasn't it? I'm just trying to remember. Put that in there. And then I need pliers for the charm. Oh, let me quickly show you these before I uh, start Rosanna's. Okay. Oh, I've got to try and hold all these on now so they don't fall off. Okay. Did I pick these up? Yeah. So, Mum, here's yours. Obviously, it needs bacon. I don't know if you can see the detail in that, obviously, because there's like lighting. Um, and then plunk it back down on here, and then Holly, there's yours. Hopefully you can see the um, uh, detail on that. You'll see it more when it's in person. Sorry about my wrist. My watch just does not like my wrist. 
it has got like a little bit on it. Yeah. So I'm just doing Rosanna's now. Holly, where do you get your clay from? If you're not using it, how much do you want for it? No, I'm joking. <laughs> um, because I've kind of found it's in quite a few places. Amazon seems to be the quickest. But it's kind of tied price-wise with Hobbycraft. So I don't really know if there's anywhere cheaper to get it. You now need 12 more. <laughs> Slave driver you, Rosanna. John Lewis? Never thought they did clay. Right, making a multi coloured string for Rosanna's. This is gonna look so cool. You see, how cool does that look? the first time I've actually done something like this so I'm gonna have to do I'm gonna have to have a little look not just like a little a little pile of wool from like a <laughs> this looks so cool. I'm just trying to get it into somewhat of a of a of a ball. I will have to have a look. Are they cheap in there, Holly? All I'm doing, all I did was was got the four colours. I've got a red. Pale pink, a blue, and a grey, and literally like rolled them into like snakes, put them together, and then just started twisting. Um, so I'm just trying to make it look like a ball of wool. That's not gonna work. Glad you like it, Rosanna Dunn. It looks nice, but it doesn't look like what it's supposed to be. Because there's so much clay, different clay in here, it's like breaking. I kind of know how I'm going to do it. I would love to, Holly, do like a little workshop, but I think they've kind of got all of their, um, um, what is it, all their stuff sorted, really. Um, if you, I don't know, if you wanted to post that you want to see it, you know, if people put in there that they want to see it, they may contact me I don't know I don't really want to be stepping on anyone's toes to be honest but I'd quite happily do it all right mum I'll see you tomorrow I'll get the um the lunch sorted What one's that, Holly?
I did speak to the lovely lady who does the um crafty the one for um sweet pea the planner one in October and I have tentatively put my name down for a stall in that event but obviously I don't know what's going to be happening like shop wise and stuff for me but I will let you guys know when I know but I'm so glad that you guys want to shop like I was so worried that you would just be like no 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 but I'm glad you want the shop, so I will let you guys know. Hi, Rosie, you're in here! <laughs> We're only saying nice things, I promise. Rosanna's like, you must have a stall. See, Rosie? Rosanna's my, my, she's like a counsellor for me. She knows me, and she knows that I really want to do a stall, but I need to, I need to practice. I've been, um, have you been in this whole time, Rosie? Um. Oh, Rosanna, do you want to Does you want to do a charm? I didn't even ask. Um. But yeah, I've tentatively put my name down for a stall. Obviously, I need to see what happens with um. One, if a, if a stall space becomes available, and two, if. I can, um, I'm making this a charm, I don't even know if you want it as a charm. Um, yeah, if a store space becomes available, I might kind of, I don't know, sell them on the Facebook group and then just bring them to the event. Oh, you've only just got it, Rosie. That's okay. That's okay. We're making charms. I'm doing requests for charms, so people are putting in what they want and challenging me. I've made... A sh uh, horseshoe. Uh, I've just finished my third ball of wool, and I've made a uh, clover, like a four-leaf clover. So if you have a an idea for a charm you want, charm is fine. Okay, I'll make the charm. Then let me know, and I will make it for you. Just put in the um, charm in. Okay, Rosanna, are you ready? Are you ready? Stop singing, Gemma. I think Stephen's going to come home in a bit and I'll just be like, <laughs> just fall asleep on the sofa. Fine, I have lentils. Right. Are you ready? It didn't quite go how I thought it was going to go. And there's once you see it in detail, you can actually see that I've put the lines in where the, the, the separate strings of wool will be. Obviously it needs bacon and, and ooh. It needs bacon and uh glazing. I think I can kinda of hold it like this. Just to show you. Obviously that bit looks a bit weird. What are you doing? It's supposed to be down there. There you go. Holding my pillars again, yes. <laughs> so yeah, so there's yours. Right, I'm gonna do one last charm. This is why it's so addictive making these. One last charm. Preferably, I know a lot of you have got stuff. Rosanna wants a B. Rosanna, I will make you a B. Even though this one coming out a bit strange. I will show you. I have that was the first one I made. I was like, oh, yeah, he's pretty cute, you know. That was the first lot of clay. And then, where's my demented one gone? Look at that. I don't know what happened to this guy. But, yeah, don't really know what happened. We'll, we'll just put him in the reject pile. Um. But, yes, I didn't put a charm in this one, unfortunately, so I can't make him a charm. But I can make one in this style. Uh, for you, Rosanna. I'll make that one off camera. Rosie, did you want one? <laughs> the main one has to be yours. <laughs> Rosie, Rosie, I'll give you an idea of some of the ones I've got. Or I've done. You've seen some of them anyway, because I've been sending them to you. 
We have Mr. Elephant. We have multitude of stars in multiple faces. Um, we have Princess Leia. We have... Oh, I forgot to show you guys this one. We have blueberries. Kind of glad I didn't put a face on this one, but... Blueberries. Um, this guy, which is one of my favourites, I think, which is my little watermelon guy. We have... Chocolate spread. Nutella. We have... If you're a Friends fan, we have... A... Chick and a duck. Um, you want a bee? Okay, I will make two bees. Two bees or not two bees? Right. This is you. You might see like an epic fail here. So let's see if I can make these bees now. I will make them the. Oh dear! I will make them the style of the old one rather than the um. The special cousin one that I've got. <laughs> right. Yellow clay. But no. It's just broken, Mum's. Um. Whoops. There you go. Right, cut this in half. Tormented bees. That's not even halfway even. Oh, come on, Jimmy. You're supposed to be good at this. Okay, right. Two bees coming up. So, here's the question for you guys. If you could develop a skill in something, doesn't have to be craft related, it could be anything. And just instantly be amazing at it. What would it be? I think for me it would probably be kind of business style stuff. Like I, I wish that I knew and was instantly really clued up with stuff like YouTube and um, kind of the behind the scenes stuff. <laughs> bees or not to bees. Rosanna, you know I laugh at your jokes. That's a good one, Holly. Mental health. I've given up on my mental health. To be honest. Even though I'm a lot better than what I was. Yeah, I think everyone's got that one thing, though, that they wish that they were better at. Um, I... If I'm not, if I can't get good at something like knitting, I will, I will hack it. I'm one of those people that will make it work for me rather than just giving up. So I'll hack like scrapbooking and stuff. I started scrapbooking in a journal, just a like 99p journal because I couldn't afford to get a big scrapbook or the scrapbooking supplies. So I just made it work for me. So I decided to scrapbook like that. Um, I don't know how I'd hack the kind of, if no, I am, I do have two, two, uh, certificates, certificates in my, uh, box of amazing paperwork you have to take everywhere, uh, that says I'm actually qualified in business. So I've got like a level, I think it's a level two in business from when I was fleeting around trying to figure out what, um, what I wanted to do. I went from head I went from childcare to hairdressing to business to beauty and then to being pregnant. <laughs> but I am trained in many things. I am a qualified hairdresser, I'm a qualified beautician and I'm qualified in business. Not that I use any of those in my day to day, but you know. Crocheting. I've seen that. My mum does that and she kind of dabbled in it for a bit and then kind of left it. Do you know how to crochet, Rosanna? I'm pretty sure you do. Driving. <laughs> I'd be a liability on the on the road. 
I've been told by multiple people to not drive. Like, one, obviously, with my glasses and stuff and that, I'm not great. But um, I just get too distracted. I'm like, what is it? They call it that, that squirrel moment when you just, like, go off on one. That's me. So I... um. I could never, I could never go on the road. I would, I'd be like, I'd kill someone. I would actually kill someone. Um, I'd just see like hobbycraft sail and then crash into the nearest uh, lamppost or like something shiny. You need me to do your makeup. I can do your makeup, hun. I am, I am trained. I actually did a showcase. The thing was, when I when I was trained, I I qualified. I did um. What did I, I in beauty? I try. I'm at because beauty comes in separate sections. So in beauty, I'm qualified in um. I think it was massage, waxing, manicures, pedicures, facials, and makeup. And I was actually preparing because at the end of the whole year, oh my line. At the end end of the year, you kind of did like a it was like a show of your stuff. So you had like models, and you had like you would basically the makeup people behind. And as I was planning for that, I found out I was pregnant with Mia, so I couldn't. I could, and I was really ill, so I couldn't. I did. I couldn't do it, which was devastating for me because I put so much work. I still qualified, but I I couldn't do like the end kind of workshop thing. And in hairdressing, I'm actually, I'm not qualified for cuts. I didn't go that high up, but I do do colouring and, like, like curling and perming and all that kind of stuff. Shellac. I do love shellac. These are, like, ones off of Amazon. I would like to know how to do it properly, though. Rosanna can crochet. We'll do a, uh, learn to crochet with Rosanna. You should be better hairstyling. I think with hairstyling, when it's yourself, you kind of need to try and pick a hairstyle that you feel confident in yourself. I mean, if you've seen my Instagram or my Facebook, I've had a multitude of hair colours and styles and lengths and all that kind of stuff. But I think it's more kind of remembering how you feel in that style or whether you think that you suit it. Like, people were quite shocked to see that when I first met Steve and I was bleach blonde like bleach blonde and I had like a pink streak down one side and a green bit under here somewhere and then I dyed it all black um and then I went back to blonde and then I went brown then I went red and then everyone seemed to dye their hair red and then I thought no I'm gonna go blue and that's kind of where I've settled and I'm kind of happy with this kind of hair length and style now but I think it's just finding your own style with it and trying a load of stuff youtube videos are pretty good for that as well oh dear dropping stuff you should do a workshop rosanna darling you're pretty good you should do one of these lives with rosanna spam the comments with yes if you think rosanna should be on the next live stream Teaching us how to crochet and seeing how rubbish they are. <laughs> now, one bee bigger than the other bee. Not good. <laughs> Everyone's putting yes. <laughs> Rosanna, the people have spoken. You are in demand. Wow, I've been streaming for two hours, man. <laughs> right, let's get these bees done. Okay, so we have the basic bodies. Don't stick together. Flipping things. Work. I'm doing the right shape. No. Just gonna shape them down.
the one thing I find the hardest colour I find to work with with clay is the black one. Big deal, a little bee. You will forever be known as the bee twins. Oh, this heat's making my nose go funny. Put that back in there. Yeah, black clay. Always, if you're gonna. Oh dear. If you're gonna do something like a, a charm of black clay, you just do the black parts last. Because it gets. Okay, I was making a charm once uh, a couple of days ago and I was using black clay, and then I kind of was doing this and then did this. And Steve said, look, I had a monobrow. <laughs> Right, let's. How did I do the stripes on that other one? I don't think I. Okay, right. You know what I need? If anyone, Rosanna, you're good at this. If anyone's good at shopping, <laughs> I have obviously this blade. I need a blade that a lot of the charm or clay people use, which is like a long. It looks like a ruler, but it's a long blade. I need that. For stuff like this because I can't cut straight I need like a proper large blade whether I can be trusted with a large blade something else entirely but you know right be number one come and get your stripe this stripe is not the same amount of thickness but you know what we are going to roll with it. He is going to rock it. And he is going to be confident. He will be the bee that has uneven stripes. And we will love him for it. I don't know what I'm waffling on about. Bees don't have perfectly shaped stripes, do they? There we go. Ooh. Oh my god, that is not straight at all. I have looked, Nelly, but I can't seem to... Like, it doesn't have a handle. It is just the blade. So I don't know whether it's... Something that is just related or you could get it in the kitchen section I don't know <laughs> Rosanna's gonna go search Rosanna's like my search the thing was I will spend hours looking for something on online and I could I would not be able to find it I tell Rosanna and she finds it in seconds it's like she has like a secret a secret cubby hole into the internet that no one else knows apart from Rosanna because I cannot find your piece of tormented and wiggly. Yeah, Rosanna has a secret cubby hole into the internet. Oh, you buy the handle separately. Okay. I don't really want a handle on it to be fair. I just need the blade. I'm guessing it would be safe to get it. Oh, John Lewis do them. There you go. Yes, I know what you mean, Natalie. It's not quite that. It's not. It's like a. It just looks like a ruler. It's like a straight line, but that knife might work. We may have to look into that. Thank you guys for having more brains than me. Right, one B has his stripes. Kind of looks like a little bit like a minion at the minute. You can do the other one. I'll try to do this quick because Stephen's going to be home soon. No. Okay. 
second B is getting his oh very wonky stripe, but it's on. It's funny if Stephen's watching this on the way home. Even though, guys, Rosanna, you'll know this, I forgot to tell you. After being on YouTube for two and a half years? Two years? Stephen, my husband, has finally subscribed to me. <laughs> He was not subscribed, and then, like, I used to give him grief about it, and be like, well, I'm subscribed to it, because if you don't know, Stephen has a YouTube channel. He does, like, football, comp comp I can't say it, comp compilation videos, like, on FIFA. Um, and as soon as he set his channel up, I subscribed, you know, being the loving, supportive wife I am. He did not subscribe to me. And it was kind of this running joke, and then he was like, oh, I'm going to be your thousandth subscriber. And then he couldn't because someone else was. So he's kind of been putting it off for God knows how long. And now, after two years, two years, no, three years of being on YouTube. And two years of marriage and ten years of being together. He's finally subscribed to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he wasn't subscribed. How out of order is that? He'll watch this back later and then give me an evil look for that. Did you threaten him with a knife? No. I did threaten to emboss him though, Rosanna. You know about that conversation. Whenever me and Rosanna get annoyed with someone. We, we make a plan to emboss them. I'm letting go of all our secrets, Rosanna. Right. You have two Bs. And they have stripes. They're not the straightest of stripes. But they'll do. Right, let's give them some faces. Not poke them in the face now. <laughs> Everyone's liking the embossed, the embossing threat. Two eyeballs. Two eyeballs. I've lost my black clay. Ooh, good for. I know. Even though them flowers are not from him, they're from um my lovely um brother's girlfriend. But he bought me Val Valentine's um, flowers in which I nearly fell over. But I know. And, and, Rosanna, he's let me buy two tubs of Ben and Jerry's coming on the shopping tomorrow. We, pass, <laughs> we passed on our wisdom or craft torches. Yeah, washi tape someone to a chair and then boss them with a bunny. A gold embossed bunny at that. Right, I'm just sticking the eyes in. These are the conversations me and Rosanna have at three in the morning when neither of us can sleep. Because you know, when you you're not able to sleep for various reasons, you decide how you're gonna to torture everyone that can sleep. <laughs> I'm gonna lose subscribers for this now. She's evil. What flavour Ben and Jerry's? Um, there's one that's a new one. It's called it's something love. It's got like pink chocolate hearts in, I believe. It's a new flavour I've not seen. We we're trying out Ocado. Ocado. Um, we normally buy from Tesco's. Home delivery, but they have been messing up our orders, being late, being rude, and substituting half the shopping. So we've changed, we've changed supermarkets, and Ocado have it's like um if you look for it, it's like it's, there's a uh, two for six pound deal on the Ben and Jerry's. Anyone knows Ben and Jerry's is normally about 
five pounds for one tub. Yeah, but one's this kind of loved one, and then another one is the salted caramel core one, which is amazing. You're glad I married him now. <laughs> Was you a bit unsure before today? Fish food is a good one, Holly, but they didn't have it in the deal with the... Because I wanted to try the new one. But they didn't have fish food in the in the deal, so I couldn't do it. I'm just making the tiniest... You probably can't even see that. Little mouth. <laughs> Rosanna's got a spoon ready. Oh God, when you're tired, don't try and make tiny mouths. There you go. The only thing with this, a good thing as well, if you're doing like black clay and you've got like a lighter colour, like I've got this yellow, I will go back in once I've stopped this stream because it's upstairs and grab my nail varnish remover on a cotton, like the, the Q-tips. Because you can use it to um, clean the clay before you bake it. So don't worry about any black clay that's transferred onto the yellow on these because they will be cleaned before they're baked. Right, tiny bit of white clay to make it cuter. And then these will be done. Might have to go to Waitrose. Yes. Keep an eye on my Instagram tomorrow because you will see it. Oh, I'm not quite sure he's in the best husband category there, Rosanna. <laughs> no, he is amazing. I do love him. He does look after me. Let's me make a complete mess of the front room. And I've got all the clay out. Right, girls, Rosie and Rosanna. Rosie and Rosanna? Are they? Are they? Yeah, it's you two that want the bees. Charms or key rings? Um, just putting these little smiles on them. Shaking now. Right, that one on there. Last little one. Come on. Thank you. Right, charms or key rings? Charm for Rosie. So I will clean these ones up before they are baked. Um, so I have transferred some of the black clay onto the, um, the Watsits, onto the yellow. Oops. Yeah. And is that a what's a key ring? Pop the little keyring in. Feels horrible stabbing them. <laughs> right, let's get rid of that so you can see. So attractive, and I do apologise. Then, right, guys, so I am going to quickly show these little bees, and then I will be heading off. So thank you to everyone who has come and joined. I can't even do these last wings now. Thank you to everyone who's come into the stream tonight. You have been awesome. If you enjoy these streams and like me, um... I would like me to do some more. I am loving these make clay streams, but obviously I will do some more crafty ones if you want me to do scrapbooking or 
planning. Sorry, I'm just sticking a wing on. Um, or, you know, watercolouring or anything like that. I will do other ones as well. But I'm glad you've enjoyed this. Um, but yeah, if you've enjoyed these and you want me to do some more, then please, please, please give this video a big thumbs up. Share it, you know, with people who you think might enjoy it, just so that it gets my tiny little channel out there and gets some more people in. So, we have little, obviously, you'll see the little black marks on it, but it will be cleaned before it's done. So, you see how much I'm shaking. Rosie, this is your little bee charm. Obviously, he needs a bit of a clean, but he will be cleaned. His little charms at the top there, and I will add the hook on the clip bit on after uh, once it's baked. So there's your little guy. Tiny little face, and then Rosanna, your guy is stuck to the paper. <laughs> there you go. There's your little bee keyring. Again, he will be cleaned and kind of neatened up a little bit before he is baked. So there's your little bee. So yeah, I am going to clean these bees and put all the others, everything else, or well, all of it, in the oven to bake um if you follow me on instagram i will pop a picture of them once they're baked on there tonight they take about half an hour so give me a little while give me about an hour to get them baked and cooled and whatever but yeah thank you so so much for, for being part of this stream i'm just popping some of this clay away so i can find my mouse um make sure you give it a big thumbs up and share it and i will probably check you guys out on instagram and chat soon Thank you. I will see you all in the next video. Bye, guys.